My goal with any rhinoplasty is to get the best result I can the first time round that I see that patient. Despite the fact that I've got considerable experience in rhinoplasty, primary and secondary, I can't guarantee that I'm going to get the result the first time round. I don't have complete control over your healing. I don't have complete control over how your tissues are going to behave during surgery. So therefore, there is always a chance of you needing more surgery. How many times this can be performed depends on what the problem is. I think it's important to take note of the fact one patient, for example, said to me, I don't care how many times you do my surgery, I just want a perfect result. So you have to bear in mind that perfection is never possible and there are times when the surgeon has to say, no, this is the best we can do. But if we do think revision is appropriate, certainly small change can be done several times to different parts of the nose, but that really shouldn't ever be the case. The things that I take into account as with any rhinoplasty are patients' expectations, can they be met, and the quality of the tissues I'm dealing with. Certainly one of the problems in revision rhinoplasty is poor skin quality and blood supply to the skin. So there are times when the safest answer is not to have more surgery because the risks are greater than the rewards.